in this video I'm going to show you how to jailbreak 8.1.1. The prerequisites is you do have to restore your, your iPad or any iOS device. The first thing you got to do is you got to turn off your lock screen passcode. So if you have Touch ID or a passcode, turn that off. So I have an iPad mini second generation so I only have a passcode. So I'm going to turn that off. Okay, I'm going to put my password in. Okay, that's off. The next thing you got to do is you got to turn off find my iPhone or find my find my iPad or whatever you have. So you go to settings, you go down to iCloud, and then you scroll down where it says find my iPad or iPhone. You want to uncheck that and then it's going to ask you for your thing. The next thing you got to do is restore your uh, your iOS device to 8.1. These are all the links I have for whatever you have. So iPad Airs, iPhones, whatever you have, just click on it, automatic downloads. The, the next thing you want to do, you want to save that download to where you can find it. Open up iTunes. The next thing you got to do is restore your iPad. So first make a backup. Back it up to your iCloud or back it up to your computer. Um, as, as you can see, I already restored it. So I'm going to set up as the new iPad. I'm going to hit um, get started. And what you want to do is you want to back it up first. And then the next thing you want to do is... Go down to where it says restore iPad, hold the shift button and click, and then a little pop-up screen will come up. Go to your desktop or wherever you saved it, click on it, and then just open it, and then it will give you this prompt. iTunes will erase and restore 8.1.1. I'm not going to do it, so I already did it. I'm going to cancel it, and I'm just going to exit iTunes just for the meantime. Okay, so the next thing you got to do is obviously you want to start your jailbreak so the step one you gotta do is download the Teji jailbreak for Windows so just click on that link it's gonna take you to a mega upload it's about 46 megabytes so you wanna click on the download I already have it I'm gonna stop it I'm gonna exit that and I believe it's Teji or Teji I don't know how to say it. I'm guessing it's Teji you wanna extract that Okay, and then the next thing you want to do is you want to open that folder and you want to right click and you want to run it as an administrator. Okay, I'm going to and then go ahead and hit yes on your UAC and then you want to connect your iPad. Okay, there it is. The next thing you want to do is you want to go to step three. So the step two is connect your iOS. Step three is you go back to Teji and then you want to uncheck it from, you want to uncheck the second the second checkbox under Cydia that is just saying that it's a Teji app store so go ahead and uncheck that and then hit the little X and then now you can hit the big green button in the center to start your jailbreak so that would be step four to conclude your jailbreak so I'm gonna go ahead and click on that green button and then I'm gonna let that load so uh, this is real time so I'm gonna let that load it should be really quick So I'm going to go ahead and just wait this out. If you want to go ahead and fast forward the video, go ahead. And as it says, it's just that simple. And you can always go to my website for all the links. So let's see, it's at 80%. So it's going really, actually quite fast. Okay, 90%. And this is real time, so it took about two minutes if even maybe 40 seconds to get to 99 and I am using the reflector software to airdrop my screen to my computer so there we go it's done you get a little smiley face I don't know what that says I'm guessing it's saying complete because you get a smiley face um okay there my iPad came back up because it restarted and there it is my iPad my iPad restarted and there is Cydia. I'm going to go ahead and open that so it can prepare the file system. Okay, it rebooted. Okay, I'm going to swipe that. And then I'm going to open Cydia again. Oops. Alright, there it is. And as you can see, I'm using Reflector. You get a seven day trial. If you want to go ahead and check them out, a link will be in the description. 
And I think it's like 12 bucks to buy it. And there's Cydia. So, I'm going to show you that I am running iOS 8.1.1. One of my settings. There's my iCloud. It's off. General. About 8.1.1 on version. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope to help. And there will be a link on the Mac version. Thank you guys for watching. And